Hey, how's it going? Hope you are having an amazing day today or this weekend. I don't know what time is in your country, your state, but uh, there's one comment uh, somebody uh, did on one of the videos that I added recently, and I'm not sure if this is what you were asking, but this video is about a search bar on your website. This can be added to any website that you have, and it's actually very easy. Uh, there's actually just an app that you can use and the way you add it is just going to the tool on the left and then see here it says search you're gonna type there and you can I already have the search here because I did it before uh, so you can just literally type search bar and then you're gonna see a few options here if you can see it says weak site search just click open and then once you see this little screen right here, you could just click add to site. And then there it is. So now there's one window that's gonna create for you because this is what's gonna be the first thing that people are gonna see after they type the code, I mean the, the keyword on the search bar. So this one can be added a little bit. So if you go to settings, you can go here, settings, change how you want the results, uh, search term, number of results, whatever you wanna do, you can uh, modify this. You can also customize this, label text or uh, you know pages, so you can do the same thing. Uh, but it's up to you if you wanna use this or you can customize it as much as you want. You can also select that way uh, you can also see how do you want the bar to look like. If you don't like that one, you can change it to, let's say, blue, or you can say, uh, change it to red. Uh, this is for this bar right here, but for this one up here, you can just go on this section and design also what you want the bar to look like. Well, let me move this right here again. Uh, if you can see here, you can make it look a little nicer. Uh, you can also Go here, customize it. Uh, you can do many different things. Now, if you select something and it doesn't change to what you selected, all you have to do is just refresh your page. Uh, I have this open for a long time, that's why it doesn't change it. So if that happens to you, just refresh the page and you should be able to do it again. Once you're happy with what it's gonna look, you just click publish and your bar is gonna start working. Now this thing um to be honest you can't change because it's just gonna be what people are gonna see before they select what's on the page so we're gonna see what it looks like now live and let's say this is your home page and somebody just want to type food then in the website itself i already have a services page so this is the first thing is gonna show you're gonna click on it and there it is. So now this is how it works. You can just type now uh, Salvadorian and it's also giving you uh, other options that are already on the website. And there it is, it's taking you back here. So yeah, it's very easy to use. Uh, if that was useful, uh, don't forget to like the video and please let me know if you have any other questions. If this is not what you meant by the search bar, let me know and I can make another video. Uh, have a wonderful day and hopefully this helps you uh, today. Take care.